Cassie here again. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a fun little hair tutorial um, for people with short to medium length hair, which is kind of what I had. I kind of had a lob, is that what I call it? It's like a long bob kind of a thing. Um, but when it's straight, it gets kind of boring. So today I decided that I was going to curl it. If you want to see how I created this look, then just stay tuned. Alright guys, let's get started. So, um, the first thing I'm gonna do is section my hair into two halves. And I actually have a ton of hair, so usually this takes me a little longer than most people just because there's so much hair to cover. So I'm just gonna tie this. And now taking this flat um, straightener that I got from... I uh, no idea where I got it from, but it's just a, just any hair straightener will do. And I'm just going to take one section of my hair. <coughs> clamp it down, turn it around, flip this over once, and just slowly pull it down like so. And there you go. You have a cute little curl. I'm just going to come a little bit closer so you guys can see. So clamp it down, flip it around, turn it around, and slowly pull down. And here's the second one. Right. So I'm just going to quickly do this side of my hair. And I'll be back. Bottom hairs like these ones down here where it's like nearly impossible to grab and flip open. Take all the little ones and just grab it and just curl it inwards. Like so. Alright, so as you can see the left side is now done want to go for that messy curled kind of look and then now I'm going to do my right side so with my right side you guys probably can see this better I'm going to take a strand from the front <coughs> then with the hair straightener pointing this way I'm going to wrap it once on top flip this towards me and just pull down And there you go. So the slower you go down, the more curly the hair will be. If you do it really fast, then the curl won't be as tight. So I'll give you another example. Say this one, Just move it over the top, flip your straightener around once, and then pulling it faster. As you can see, this curl is a lot looser than this one because I went a lot faster. So I think Ow! Oh my god! Oh! Don't put that part in the video. Alright, so burning yourself is prone to happen, so be very careful. Wear um, hand gloves if you don't want to be like me. Okay, now moving <coughs> to the important part of the hair, which is the top. So I'm going to do a middle part for this look, so I'm just going to find the middle part of my hair and split it. Oh my god, my hair looks so crazy right now. Alright, so the top is the scariest and most stressful part. So I'm going to do that part last. It's going to leave a chunk at the front and then a chunk at the back. 
This will be my front chunk, so I'm just gonna do the one starting over here. We're just gonna go in and curl these ones as well, as well. But I like to leave them last just because I mess them up really easily. So I kind of want to know that the rest of my hair is done before I have to think about it. Okay, so taking this big chunk right here, gonna comb it, make sure there's no knots in it. And then same thing, roll it up, turn it around, and pull down. One side. And don't worry if it looks like you know too high and all. It looks kind of weird right now. We're gonna fix it later. And then the right side. <coughs> For the right side, I'm gonna just split it into two parts. All right. So now you have these <laughs> really funny looking curls, but don't worry. We're gonna fix it up. So what I like to do is flip my hair around and then I'm gonna take <coughs> to take some dry shampoo and then right in between my hair, right, doesn't matter anywhere really, just spray a little bit of that and then rub it in. So this stuff just makes your hair have more volume at the top because usually that's where it's kind of flat. And other side. Just rub it in. <coughs> okay, so now we're just gonna play with it until we're happy with what we've got. Using some argan oil, put a pea sized drop on my hand, and then I'm just gonna run my hair through this argan oil. And this will just make it look a little bit shinier and not so frizzy. So I go in, and so now that I kind of have an idea of how I want it to look like. I'm just gonna go into these bigger chunks over here and then I'm separating them and then curling them individually. Alright, well anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little hair tutorial. Um, <coughs> well, I hope you guys liked it. If you guys did, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Okay, bye guys!